In the heart of India's digital transformation lies a system that connects billions. Aadhaar, a robust, secure and seamless process ensures that Aadhaar authentication facilities are accessible to everyone. Let's understand how these agencies start their process. To provide seamless Aadhaar authentication facilities, UIDAI onboards Authentication User Agencies AUA, EKYC User Agencies KUA, Sub Authentication User Agencies Sub AUA and Sub EKYC User Agencies Sub KUA. But before we go into the details of the process, let's examine the role of these agencies. AUA is a requesting entity that provides Aadhaar authentication services to Aadhaar number holders using the yes or no authentication facility. KUA on the other hand goes a step further by using the EKYC authentication facility provided by UIDAI. The role of sub AUA is in facilitating yes or no authentication through an existing AUA while sub KUA facilitates EKYC authentication through an existing KUA. While AUAs and KUAs have no yearly transaction limits, sub AUAs usually conduct 50,000 to 1 crore authentication transactions annually. Let us now get to the process of onboarding AUAs or KUAs to avail Aadhaar authentication facility. The journey begins when the requesting entity reaches out to UIDAI's onboarding team on onboarding at UIDAI.net.in and submits a formal request under the legal provisions of Aadhaar Authentication and Offline Verification Regulations 2021. Upon satisfactory initial review, the onboarding team provides a set of documents to the applicant to be signed, stamped and submitted. After the satisfactory review, scrutiny and verification, the file is then formed forwarded for the approval from the authority. After the approval, the authority then sends an in-principle approval along with the set of annexures. This procedure must be completed within 90 days in which the pre-onboarding audit is to be concluded within 30 days of the pre-onboarding audit fee payment. After the agreement execution, the onboarding team sends a request email to the authentication support team containing all the essential information and initiates the process of providing the pre-production access to the requesting entity, including a welcome kit, pre-production key, encrypted license key and password. The requesting entity must complete testing and information security IS compliance audit within 30 days. After the successful testing and approval in pre-production environment, the authentication support team validates the transaction done by the entity and on approval, the requesting entity receives production access to start operations. Now let's take a look at the onboarding process for sub AUA or sub KUA. The application of the requesting for sub AUA or sub KUA must be routed through the key managerial point of contact (MPOC) of an existing AUA or KUA. The requesting entity can opt for an AUA or KUA from the list available on the UIDAI website. They further need to fill the sub AUA KUA form duly attested by an authorized signatory with complete details of MPOC, technical point of contact or TPOC, authentication modality and purpose of authentication as per the provisions of the Aadhaar Act. The form is submitted along with an authorization letter by the concerned head of department or organization, published gazette notification as notified under applicable section 7, section 44B1, 44B2 and section 47 and a joint undertaking with the AUA or KUA to the UIDAI onboarding team. Once approved from the authority, applicant needs to pay the license fee and is then mapped into the pre-production environment. An IS audit report conducted by a certain impaneled auditor with artifacts and evidences should also be submitted. After final vetting of the audit report by UIDAI, the sub AUA KUA is then mapped into the production environment, marking the beginning of their operations. This intricate onboarding process of AUA KUA to facilitate Aadhaar authentication showcases the behind the scenes look at this transformative technology in action. Onboarding these agencies emphasizes the crucial role of Aadhaar in building a more seamless, interconnected and secure digital future.